Debbie Birch and I'm with the Queen Anne's County Office of Tourism and we're here today in the studio to talk about some summer events that are going on and I have Jenny Gallagher from the Queen Anne's County Library. She's going to tell us about the summer teen reading program and the, the different ones and she's been telling me some stuff off camera and I'm just blown away by how much participation there is. So Jenny, welcome. Thanks for coming. Thanks for having me. And this program, it's called Spark a Reaction? It is. We have science based, um, a science based theme this summer. Okay. And so what are the kids, what, what, do, what is it? How do we get in? How do they get in and that kind of stuff? So it's really easy to sign up for the summer reading program. All they have to do is come into the library at some point during the summer, okay. write down their name and age on a sheet of paper, and that's it. That's it. And They're it's registered. either Centerville or Stevensville libraries, yes. right? Okay. And then what what type of programs do you have during oh, the... Oh, we have so many programs this summer. Um, one that's ongoing throughout, a couple are ongoing throughout the year. We have mm -hmm. our teen advisory board at the Centerville branch. Okay. So at this board, we allow teens to come in and kind of have a say in what happens at the library so they can oh, help that's make... nice. Um, help decide what books we're going to purchase, help plan programs, come up with book lists, okay. things like that. So it really just gives them a say. And then at the Kent Island branch, um, Julie will be continuing her teen writers group which meets throughout the year. Okay. And then they just, they work on writing, obviously. They and, do. Okay. It's been a pretty pro popular group so far. All right. She's had, a, she's had a lot of kids come every month that they do it. Okay. So tell us about the Spark a Reaction program that you have going on and all the different um, I don't know, do you call them workshops, classes, what do you? We call them programs. So programs. the Spark Reaction is just really the theme for our summer reading mm -hmm. program for teens this year. It starts on Monday, June 16th, and runs through July 31st. Okay. So we'll have programs throughout that time for teens to come to. Um, and Spark Reaction really just is kind of the science theme, which is a national theme, but then we also do a lot of programs just at our libraries. Okay. So a couple of big ones that teens might be interested in, we are doing a Fault in Our Stars book discussion, and if they've seen the movie, they should also come. That, because that just opened like last week or It did, week it was really good. Ago. So that was a book first? It was, it's written by okay. John Green, and it's been extremely popular at the library, so if kids are a fan of that, they okay. should definitely come for that. Um, we're having Lego Mania catapults at our Kent Island branch, so you use Legos and then you can just shoot things across the library. Uh, that's what I'm thinking. I'm, I'm hearing catapults, so th yes. they actually build the, yes, the catapult there? Yes, there are a couple there. of different sets of directions, okay. and then they just go to town with the Legos and fling stuff around. Okay, and what's the age groups for these different? Um, the Fault in Our Stars is going to be 13 to 18, okay. and the Lego Catapults is all ages. Okay. Oh, wow. The Teen Advisory Board and the Teen Writers Groups are really middle school and high school. Okay. Anything else going on over the summer? Yes. Um, we're going to be showing a movie at the library that's based off of a book for teens. We have a very large screen in our meeting room at the Centerville branch, so we'll project a movie that. onto that. Yes. Okay. And then we're also going to have a chocolate party at the Centerville branch. Okay. We're pretty much just going to eat chocolate. Nice. That's the party. Um, there'll be some chocolate themed games like can you figure out which candy bar is which without the wrappers? Okay. Can you tell the difference between dark and milk chocolate? It's really just an excuse to come to the library and eat chocolate. All right. And so these programs, what's the cost for those? The programs are all completely free. Free. You do not charge for free. anything at the library. Okay. So, you know, and you guys are open six days a week? We Is are. It? We're open six days a week, Monday through Thursday. We're open 10 to 8, and Friday and Saturdays 9 to 5. Okay. And, um... To find out more information, uh, the website, which is up on the screen, but it's qaclibrary.org, correct? Yes. New website. Um, and all the programs are listed on there. Yes. If you go under a 10, you'll find calendars, and there should be a children's, a teen, and an adult. And if you can just go to the correct age group, and we have all of the programs on there, including descriptions and whether or not you need to register for okay. them. Okay. And they, and they do fill up... Um, they do. We've already started. We started registration for our programs on May 30th. Uh -huh. um, a couple of programs at our Ken Island branch are completely full now. Wow. Um, we're closing in on being full at some programs at our Centerville branch. Okay. Um, but the only program for teens that requires registration is actually our Chibi Drawing. 
Um, so if kids are really into graphic novels and manga, they can come and learn how to draw their own characters. Oh, okay. Oh, that's interesting. So it's yeah. a drawing type thing, too. It is. We had the same person come last year, and I know she's been at the Arts Council as well. Okay, and she teach that. You know, I have. I did see that advertised at the Arts Council, yeah. Council and didn't know what it was. Yeah. Okay. So there's just, there's something for everybody. We have all sorts of things going on yeah. at the library this summer. Yeah, so everybody get out, um, go online, look and see what the programs are, go into the library, ask, and along with all the other things that go on, you guys rent videos, you we rent do. iPads, is that We what do, we saying? have iPads for use within the library. We okay. have 10 at each branch. And I'm saying rent, you can loan <laughs> them. Yes. Um, and, and speaking of the iPads, you said there's uh, the team, Oh, we do have prizes for the teens this summer. Thank you for reminding me. For yep. every couple of books the teens read, they can enter to win a prize. Okay. We're giving away prizes every two weeks. Um, so it's a get, an Amazon gift card and an iTunes gift card. Very nice. And then we have a grand prize at the end of the summer of an iPod Nano. So everybody who enters to win, win the gift cards will be entered to win the, the grand prize. Okay. And all you have to do is read to... Yes. It's really simple. You just have to read. Okay. Well, I thank you for coming in, and I hope that all your programs fill up and then some more. Thank you. <laughs> so thank you.